Your Roku PIN is a crucial security feature that controls parental settings, prevents unauthorized purchases, and restricts channel additions. If you've forgotten your PIN or need to update it, there are two main methods to reset it. Method one is the online reset, which is the easiest and most common approach. This method allows you to reset your PIN through the Roku website without affecting any of your other settings. First, open your web browser and navigate to my.roku.com. You'll need to sign in to your Roku account using your email and password. Once logged in, look for PIN preference or PIN slash parental controls in your account settings. This section contains all the PIN-related options for your Roku account. Next, select Update or Change PIN. Then enter your new four-digit PIN. Make sure to choose a PIN that's memorable but secure. Finally, save your changes to complete the reset. If you've forgotten your account password, don't worry. Simply click the Forgot Password option on the login page, and Roku will send you a password reset link via email. Method two is the factory reset which should only be used as a last resort when the online method fails. This will completely erase all your Roku settings, including your PIN, channels, and preferences. To perform a factory reset, go to Settings, then System, then Advanced System Settings, and finally select Factory Reset. You'll need to follow the on-screen instructions and enter a confirmation code. If you encounter issues during the PIN recovery process, here are some troubleshooting tips. Check your internet connection, Restart your Roku device and verify that you're using the correct email address associated with your account. Remember, the online reset method is usually sufficient and won't affect your other settings. Only use the factory reset if absolutely necessary and be prepared to set up your Roku device again from scratch. Understanding how to effectively manage Roku parental controls requires knowing the scope and limitations of your PIN settings. The Roku PIN system has specific areas where it applies, and many streaming services require their own separate parental control setup. First, it's crucial to understand that your Roku account PIN primarily affects because the Roku channel and live TV inputs. This is a common misconception. Many users think the Roku PIN controls all streaming services, but it doesn't. For popular streaming services like Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, and Amazon Prime Video, you must set up parental controls individually within each app. Each service has its own parental control system that operates independently of Roku's PIN. To disable your PIN entirely, you can sign in to my.roku.com, navigate to PIN slash parental controls, and select Don't Require a PIN for Purchases and Adding Apps. For the Roku channel parental controls, you can select off to disable those restrictions. For more comprehensive parental control features, such as screen time limits and app blocking, consider using third-party parental control apps like Questodio. These apps provide broader control across multiple devices and platforms. Finally, Keep your Roku device updated with the latest firmware to ensure you have the most recent parental control features and security improvements. Regular updates help maintain the effectiveness of your parental control settings.